today I'm gonna be unboxing my glossy box for November. If you can hear anything, it's Jamie playing on the Xbox upstairs, but you shouldn't be able to PlayStation, but you shouldn't be able to hear it too much. Also, we've got a new mirror with lights on it. I think it looks really cool. And I do apologize for any kind of washing you might see, any rubbish or anything like that. I didn't have time to tidy up and clean. I am gonna be creating like a nice, proper background very soon but i am just a little bit busy at the minute but i thought that i would do for this video my glossy box unboxing i used to do these every single month and i kind of stopped a little bit um because i was moving house i was really really busy and now i I don't know I've got my glossy box this month and I was really excited because the things in it are actually really good so I am going to show you what's in there if you don't know what a glossy box is it is a monthly subscription to beauty products you get different products each month you get different products each month all um over the value of I think it's like I don't know what it is that over the value of like 60 pounds or something like that like it's really good and you're only paying 10 pounds so I am going to unbox mine this month they are very consistent with like the, the times that they post, like they post very well. So this is what the box looks like. Obviously it is packaged up a lot better than this. I have literally just shoved it together because I am filming this video and because, because I've already opened it up. But there is some really great products in it this month. So some months have got a theme. In fact, most months have got some kind of a theme. And this one, it's winter warmers. That just looks so cozy. Like it just gives like a really nice cozy vibe. So that is this month's. And inside here, it kind of explains all of the products, what you get, prices of them, everything about it. And then it gives you a little sneak peek as to what is in next month. So I'll tell you that at the end. Um, but I'm just gonna talk you through the products. So the first, Thing is from Mud Maskey. Now they have put in a product from Mud Maskey before, and I thought, wow, this is a really expensive product. This is a Leave Me On Winter Mask, and it's actually £43.50, and this is the full size. So this product is £43.50. This is what it looks like, and basically it's like a moisturizing, nourishing mask. So it's a so it is basically a face mask, but it's kind of like a moisturizing thick one. I used this the other night. Obviously, at the minute I am using Body Shop products mainly, but I still will, you know, include other bits of skincare here and there. It is really super, super softening. I wouldn't say it's worth the money, £43.50 for this product. I would not say it's worth it um, unless you really do have the money to just kind of waste. I would say that it does work really, really well and really nicely. And the description for this says, with autumn drawing to a close, it's time to trade in your lightweight hydrator for this rich, moisturizing mask. It not only creates an invisible shield on the surface of your complexion, protecting it from blustery weather, but it also repairs and nourishes dry, cracked and flaky skin. Apply a thin layer onto your face after cleansing and you'll have healthy, moisturized skin despite the cold. That is a really good one and I was very excited to get that. The second product in the box is actually a hand cream and this is from Rituals. So it's the Ritual of, it's the Ritual of Ayurveda Soothing Hand Balm. I can't pronounce whatever the name of this is, um, but yeah, it is Indian Rose and Sweet Almond Oil Scented. So this is what the packaging looks like. It's quite a kind of standard hand cream. I would say it is quite nice and moisturizing and nourishing for your hands but compared to ones at the body shop because obviously I do sell products from the body shop so I do know them very well but uh, and I am going to compare skincare to that compared to the body shop the body shop one is a 10 out of 10 and this I would say is a 5 because I know that the body shop hand creams are really really good but it is still a good hand cream so I don't know if I'll just pass this on to somebody or something like that because I don't need this because I I just don't need it but the description for that says when the cold weather hits there's nothing more essential than a moisturizing hand cream luckily for you this luxurious hand balm is specifically formulated to treat dry and cracked skin it blends sweet almond oil with indian rose to soften and nourish your hands simply massage a pea-sized amount into your skin and cuticles every day to keep them hydrated all winter long this retails for nine pounds ninety so you know a semi-decent price and the smell it does smell really really nice but it's not my cup of tea particularly because i have got better um, the next product is actually a cleanser and it's a mini sized cleanser so this is from ketaphil so 
Cetaphil. I think that's how you pronounce it. I'm not sure. Please correct me if I'm wrong. And this is a gentle skin cleanser. So as you can see, that is the mini sized. And the mini size is £1.10. So a decent price. The full size of it is £8.99. But yeah, for £1.10, that's absolutely fine. It's like a good travel size, I would say. I did use this the other day. It is very gentle. It is meant for people with sensitive skin. If you've got sensitive skin, using harsh products is just going to make your skin worse. So things like this will work really, really well. It does lather up really well. It does clean your face, but in kind of more of a calming way. So I am going to be using this every single morning. I will let you know how I get on with this. Um, but I personally don't have sensitive skin, so I can't really, you know, say if it reacts to anything like that because I won't necessarily know but yeah that's a really good product and the description for that is did you know that the winter chill weakens your skin barrier causing sensitivity dryness and irritation well this gentle cleanser removes makeup dirt and impurities without stripping your skin of its natural oils or upsetting its ph levels massage a pea-sized amount onto your face then rinse with warm water or simply wipe off with a cotton pad for silky soft skin you can actually buy this from super drug as well the next product which is the product that i was most excited about this month and i was buzzing to get this product so i don't know if i wasn't been in focus this whole time let's hope so fingers crossed um but this is from candy cosmetics most of the time in my glossy box i haven't actually heard of the brand so i have heard of this one and this is a 120 ml bottle of their glow up primer and a setting spray so it's like one of those shimmery mists so you shake it and it goes all kind of glittery and shimmery can you see that so it's just like a really nice product sorry i don't think it kind of zoomed in well on my sage handbook for accounting has just fallen but yeah this is a product that you put on just before you do your makeup so like a primer it gives a nice glow to your skin and then after you've done your makeup if you want your skin to be even glowier you can just spritz it over it's not a wet mist like when i was spraying it i didn't even realize it was going onto my face it's very fine which means that you're not going to kind of get your makeup running everywhere it doesn't you know you don't see water particles over your face it doesn't run down your face it's just a nice gentle mist across your face so it's a really good product and this retails for 20 pounds um, I believe it's not something that I would buy with my own money, but it's definitely something I was very excited to get. So I'll let you know with this and I will use it in a future makeup tutorial. And the description for this says, forget dull winter skin. This two-in-one shimmery primer and setting spray will keep you glowing all season long. Spritz it onto your cleansed face before applying your foundation for a natural lit from within glow or use it to set your makeup for an iridescent finish. You can also spray it over your whole body to look like a shimmery goddess. Just shake it well before use. Yeah, because if you don't shake it, it will settle and the water will be there and the glitter will be at the bottom. So you have to shake it to make sure that the glitter gets all the way through it. Then the next product, you did actually get quite a lot of good stuff this month. It was worth about 80 plus pounds this month. So that was really good. And this product I actually really like and I used it the other day. So this is from Hair Exotics and it is the hair oil and I think this one is their hair shine oil so it's there to kind of moisturize and hydrate it's in a little bottle like this and this is actually a full size bottle it won't focus on it because I've just made it focus on my face yeah it is just a small kind of bottle it is full size and it is £2.49 so it's a decent price for this um, a little does go a long way which is what I like about this I have previously in a previous glossy box been given a different hair oil and in comparison to that one i can't remember what brand that is but in comparison to that one this one is so 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 much better and yeah the brand is hask exotic so i it's like i think they're playing on the words hair mask but I, I don't know if that works too well but yeah i do really really like the product and it does nourish and the description for that says give your tresses the extra nourishing boost they need this winter lightweight and alcohol free this hair oil absorbs instantly and provides a beautiful shine with no oily residue you'll either receive a nourishing coconut oil that hydrates and softens a smoothing keratin oil that smooths and reduces frizz or a repairing argan oil that restores dry and damaged hair so there was like three potential ones that you could get in your glossy box which one did i get I think I got the coconut one. Yeah, I got the coconut oil one, which I'm very happy about because I do like the smell of coconut. So yeah, that's that one. And then the final two things, I think is just like a little added extra because it's kind of like coming into winter time. It's like cozy. These are tea. I think it's actually loose leaf tea. I'm not sure. 
or maybe it's not i don't know if they're in tea bags or not but you um, i might do an overlay clip i'm not sure um i do have a tea strainer if they are loose leaf but these are from off black and they're fruit tea so we've got the forest fruits and ginger fruit tea one here and then the other one is spicy orange and ginger black tea so you won't add any milk or anything um so yeah and it tells you on the back how much caffeine it, there is in there um what temperature the water should be when it hits it and how long it takes to brew um the black tea one has got high caffeine level whereas the forest fruits and ginger has a zero caffeine level so it depends the kind of person that you are because i know a lot of people don't like to use um or don't like to consume too much caffeine so yeah those products are really nice oh yeah each individual packet is worth 84p whereas if you bought a full size bag of them it would be £9.98 and the description says nothing beats a warming hot drink on a cold November night that's why we're treating you to delicious fruit teas spicy orange and ginger black tea plus a fruit forest fruits and ginger blend simply infuse your tea bag into boiling water for at least three minutes it's a tea bag okay not loose leaf then slip under a cozy blanket and save with this heartwarming cuppa I do like tea, but I don't think I will like these because they're fruit teas. But I might just give them a try anyway, or maybe I'll give them one one because I don't want it to be wasted on me. So those are all the products that I got in my glossy box. This was definitely a really good month this month because you do get like £70 more sort of worth of products than what you pay for. If you don't want to know what's in next month, then just skip off the video, but they do give you a sneak peek. It says sneak peek for December. We're ending 2019 with a bang filled with full size products, radiance boosting products. Our special design December box will keep you glowing from head to toe this festive season. You'll receive a range of nourishing skincare and shimmery makeup, including a multi-purpose loose pigment powder for your eyes and cheekbones. And yeah, so the, 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 one of the products, they always tell you what one of the products is going to be, and it's going to be, I would say that means it's a highlighter, so that'll be interesting to, show, to see. They always put in, which I find really weird, loose products, like loose powders, loose blusher, and now a loose highlighter, and I'm not like the biggest fan of loose products because they get everywhere, but we'll have to see. I think I'll just use it anyway. So yeah, that's everything in my glossy box. And I will do another one next month. So remember to subscribe and I'll see you in my next video.